Hey YouTube, what's up? How the fuck you guys doing today? It's your boy Dar Flinny and He's doing pretty good. Pretty fucking good if I don't say so myself. I toss that. But Fucking tired. But, you know, shit happens. You gotta make that money, though. And remember, stay hydrated. So, topic today. Hmm, let me see. Yep, no clue. Winston. Uh, I can go inside, but I'm not ready for that yet. Stayed late at work today, so making that money. That's all you can do these days, you know. My word. Looks like I got a fucking nest in my hair. With my fucking receding hairline. Going bald, your boy's going bald. <laughs> Yeah, not as everywhere today. Kept the window up on my way home. Oh. So, one of the suburbs here was under bomb threat. I don't know if it's over yet or not but there was SWAT there the entire suburb was evicted or not evicted but escorted out recent events well Labor Day actually ended up with Two fires and an explosion. To turn around a couple weeks later and hey, let's call in a bomb threat. Because <laughs> we're fucking idiots. I wasn't loved as a kid, so I need attention. You know, I really don't get it. I mean, really, what? is the actual point. You know? So you're, you're mad at one person. Or you're mad at society. You know? You're mad at one person. Okay. Deal with it to their face. You know? Don't be a pussy and involve everyone in your stupidity. got a problem with society well fucking get up and change it I mean really what what are you doing you have a problem with society you're sitting there fucking bitching about it but won't get up and try to make a difference won't even attempt to make a difference You know, don't fucking get it. But, you know, 
stupid will be stupid. Oh, oh, oh. oh God, what the hell? So, a couple days ago, got bit by pretty sure a spider. Which Okay, big whoop. I'm still alive. I'm not in the hospital. So, usually just get over it. You know, it happened. Move on with life. Well, it's the area that this spider decided to bite. And I can tell you this, that's my no-no box. And it decided to get fresh. Which is why I didn't make a video yesterday. But the problem with getting bit in an O and O box by a spider or anything else is it is directly into the bloodstream. Meaning it is going to progress a lot faster. Not only that, it is going to hit a lot harder. So, yeah. When you're laying in bed at night, make sure no spiders get to your no-no box. It sucks and you will be uncomfortable for days after. And depending on the spider, that's if you survive it. Don't want no widow biting you there, that's for sure. Mm -mm. But quite a conversation to have with your co-workers. I mean, talking to you guys on YouTube about it, okay, big whoop, you know? Talking to the wife or a doctor about it, hey, they need to know, you know? When you're sitting there talking to your co-workers and you're like, hey, I got bit by a spider in my junk. <laughs> it's like, hmm, awkward work arrangement there. No. Unless you're like me, then it's like, big whoop, I'll strip down and fucking play air guitar naked. Because why not? Go to a party, whoo, there goes the clothes, just like Gray. <laughs> okay, if you guys don't know, Gray is a character from Fairy Tale, and if you have not yet watched it, you should. But I think I'm gonna get off here for this one just a little bit. I'm tired, I'm hungry, and I'll catch you guys next time.